know the old saying that uh, uh, if you keep doing the same thing and expect different results, then uh, that's not very realistic. We've had Democratic majorities in our legislature for a long time, and during the past decade or two, we've seen uh, a flattening of our population. Uh, we've seen an aging of the population of Vermont. We have fewer and fewer young people in our schools, fewer working age individuals and families. Um, so the trajectory of our demographics is, is very unfavorable. It doesn't bode well for the state's economic future. The question I think voters need to ask themselves is why? Why aren't more people staying here or moving here? And I think the answer is pretty obvious. It's not an affordable place to live. We have high taxes. We have a, a high cost of uh, health insurance. We have housing costs that are beyond the reach of many people in our state. Um, we have uh, um, uh, higher education costs that are much higher, even for our public institutions uh, compared to other places around the country. So we have to attack those uh, those uh, problems. I called it, when I was in office, a crisis of affordability. We need to uh, uh, focus on them, to bring those costs down, and I believe in the end people are rational. They'll do what's in their own personal uh, best interest, and if they can afford to live in Vermont, who wouldn't want to?